I give the floor to Al-Salam Foundation. Madam High Commissioner, Al-Salam and ADHRB congratulate you on your appointment as High Commissioner for Human Rights. As you assume your mandate, we would like to call your attention to the deterioration of the human rights situation in Saudi Arabia, in particular the widespread arrests of women's rights activists and human rights defenders, as well as the continued suppression of the rights of freedom of expression, assembly and association. When Saudi Arabia granted women the right to drive in June 2018, it appeared women's rights took a step forward, but the arrests of dozens of women's rights activists, including those who vocally campaigned for the right to drive, has meant two steps backwards. Many of these human rights defenders remain arbitrarily detained in prisons on spurious and unsubstantiated state security charges, including Samar Badawi, Nasima al Sada, and Lujain al Hathlul. The arbitrary detention of women's rights activists is part of a larger campaign by officials to suppress dissent and jail peaceful critics. Since last July, scores of people critical of the government have been arrested, including clerics, writers, academics, journalists, and human rights defenders, such as Salman al Auda, Mohammed al Bajadi, and Omar al Said. This coordinated campaign comes as Saudi Arabia attempts to enhance its image on the global stage. But these actions are not those befitting a four time member of the Human Rights Council or a member of the UN Commission on the Status of Women. Madam High Commissioner, we hope that you will continue your office's commitment to call out all human rights abusers, including the rich and powerful. Thank you.